Good morning class. Our lesson this morning is about photographic film and paper. That was under lesson 5. Black and white film is basically made up of emulsion, gray or anti-halation backing, and the support base. Emulsion is consists of crystal light sensitive compound or the silver nitrate. It is being distributed throughout the plastic base material. Anti-halation backing or the gray is placed between the emulsion and the plastic base. The purpose is to prevent the light passes through the emulsion which form a halo. Another, the last one is the base. Base is generally bay made up of plastic materials. They, suffer, they serve as support to the emulsion. Another one is the characteristic of black and white film. Number one is emulsion speed. Emulsion speed are being indicated as follows. Number one is ASA or the ASA. ASA stands for American Standard Association. It is being expressed in arithmetical value. Number two is the DIN. DIN stands for Dutch Industry Normin, which is being expressed in logarithmic value. Another one is the ISO. ISO stands for International Standard Organization. It is being expressed in a combination of arithmetical value and logarithmic value. Another characteristic of black and white film is the spectral sensitivity. The different classification of film is according to its spectral sensitivity. Okay, we have the blue sensitive film, okay, or chromatic film, panchromatic film, and the infrared film. Okay, another characteristic of black and white film is the granularity or the grainness. This refers to the size of metallic silver grains that are formed after development of unexposed film. What we are talking class is the ancient camera before. Diba? Because the camera before class, they are using film. Okay, they need film in order to produce an image. Kailangan yung film, okay, ilalagay dun sa camera, and there are only limited number of shots, di ba? Okay, mayroon lang po is 12, 24, and 36. Okay, that was the camera used before. Before the digital camera being introduced into the market, nowadays okay another is the color film the color film is the multi-layer emulsion coated on the same support base 
the top of emulsion is sensitive to the blue light only. We have two types of color film before. We have the negative or non reversal film. Okay, wherein it give or negative or non reversal film either negative or positive image depending on how it is being used. Example for this is Koda Color, Fuji Color, and Agfa Color. Okay, another, another um, types of color film is the reversal film or the suffix chrome is applied to reversal materials. This film, when processed, a positive image or transparency for project projection viewing. Example is Kodakrum, okay, Agfakrum, or the Fujikrum. Okay, those are available in the market before. Okay, let us pr proceed now, class, on photographic, photographic paper. paper or the black and white. Modern photographic paper are basically composed of light-sensitive coating or the emulsion. The paper based or the support. Characteristic of, of photographic paper. Number one is emulsion speed. Emulsion speeds, number one is chloride paper. Okay, take note class, ah. chloride paper has a slow speed and is contact printing. Um, slow speed lang, okay, slow speed lang po when you are using the chloride paper okay from bromide paper you are using fast speed okay recommended for ito for projecting printing or enlarging diba? okay if you are using paper chlorobromide it is the multi-speed wherein it could be used on both contact printing or enlarging. Take note of that. Huh? That is what we so-called the chlorobromide paper. Because the characteristic of photographic paper, it depends upon on the speed. Okay. You never use a certain paper which is not indicated on the speed that you are going to use. Okay, next, another characteristic of photographic paper is the exposure and development latitude. Okay, the exposure or development latitude, it is the degree or the amount which you can deviate from idea, ideal exposure or development without the loss of print quality. Okay. We have the exposure latitude, developmental latitude, wherein the paper, paper do not change in contrast and image to a reasonable variation and development has a good latitude. Okay, next is the contrast range or grade. In black and white printing, it is necessary to adjust the paper contrast so they can yield a natural scene result from negative with density range that are either too high or too low. Okay, the most photographic paper that the contrast range or grade are indicated by number of 0 to 5. 
Okay, 0 to 5 po yun. That is the indicator. Okay, the physical characteristic under this category, physical characteristic, photographic paper comes in different surface based on their thickness or the weight and color. Okay. Another class is the photographic paper for color printing. It is essential, similar to the film used in camera, except that the emulsion layer are coated on the paper base and contains a coupler which are colorless. The colored coupler are not used because the print would then be unsuitable for direct viewing. Take note, class, huh? if you are using black and white film, okay, if you are using black and white film, okay, the developer that you are going to use or the chemicals that you are going to use must be black and white also. If you are co using colored pictures or colored film, you are using colored, colored chemicals and developing process. Okay, that's all about in lesson 5. Okay, your evaluation must be on page 27. Okay, the self-assessment question. Okay, that was on page 27 class. Kindly write the answer on the self-assessment question number 5. That was on lesson 5. That's all for this morning class. Thank you and God bless.